The Tatiyama Kurobe Alpine Route. It's a sightseeing route that connects Toyama and Nagano prefectures, where you can see the mountains of northern Japan Alps while riding various vehicles. In spring, it's especially famous for a majestic snow corridor, whose snow walls reach up to 20 meters high. Last month, we went to this Tateyama Kurobe Alpine route, and it was a fantastic trip. So that's today's quest on Japanese Quest. The date was April 20th. We are Japanese locals, so we went there by car, but it's also relatively easy to reach by public transport. There are two ways to get to this route, one from the Toyama side and the other from the Nagano side. Personally, I recommend it from the Nagano side, and I will talk about the reason later in this video, but for now, Let's start our trip from the Ogizawa Station on the Nagano side. From the Ogizawa Station, we take four vehicles to the summit, and the first one is the electric bus. さあ、行きましょう。今終点のね、黒部ダム駅というか着きました。行きます。ちょっと展望台行ってみますか。お、なんかすごいやばい気配がある。うわ。うわ、ごっついね景色。うわ。うわ、すごい。うわ、やばい
ただきます。いやいやついたんでブロド。ブロドです。So this is Brodo, the highest point of this route. The altitude here is 2,450 meters. There is a hotel in this building if you want to spend the night. But for now, let's go outside and see the view. Let's go outside and see the view. さあ行きましょうかじゃあ一応今回のハイライトであるあのね氷の壁雪の壁が左右にあるところ行きますかいい今これで何メートルぐらいかね何回だろうねうわやばいねだんだんどんどん高なっていくよねえ,ー、えこれもう何メートルぐらいだ1234階建てぐらいあるかなそしたらもう15メートルとかうわすごいなちなみにやっぱ来るんだったら4月の方が高いんだよねやっぱどんどん溶けてくんで6月よりもね4月のオープンした直後に来るのがベストっすねうわすごいここ一番高いところだ<笑>最高地点高いね何メートルあるかな18ぐらい1階2階3階456階建てぐらいあるなめちゃめちゃ綺麗だねやっぱぜひあれだなこれちょっと歩くところ来た方がいいね湯気もあるよな温泉だ温泉湧いてるのかなさあということでこの室堂だな<笑>すごい綺麗なねめちゃくちゃ綺麗いやー今日はもうこの景色でエンディングでいいでしょうはいお疲れ様でした<笑>言葉を失ってます<笑>眩しい眩しいそれは知らない<笑>サングラスかけてるのサングラスサングラスサングラス So that was the Tateyama Krobe Alpine Route in April It's very beautiful and really recommended So, as I said in the beginning, we went by car. So, we started from the Nagano side, took a round trip to the summit, and came back and picked up the car. And if you want to do a round trip like us, we recommend the Nagano side because, as we saw in the video, you can also visit the marvelous Kurobe Dam. But if you go by public transport, it's a good idea to enter from one side and go through the other and continue the rest of your Japan trip. In that case, it doesn't matter which side you start from, I'm sure you will enjoy equally. If you want to know more details about this place, their official website is quite informative, so I will put its link in the description below. And if you like this video, please consider to subscribe. Because there are so many more beautiful places in Japan that we'd like to show you. Okay, so、uh, I think that's it for today. Yeah, thank you for watching Japanese Quest. See you next time.